like life's begun This will be a special one Go out and make someone's day Every day you make mine by being my son It's really great to be back. Dude, we can hang out every day. Oh my god. Holy crap. What? Is that an arm? That's an arm. Nobody move. Let's poke it with a stick. I call first! Six human souls harvested because a sentimental old goat could not keep them in the ruins. Toriel. And with every life lost, of course, I had to take it out on you. I intended to hurt you. I wanted to hurt you. I had to be sure you were pained with the same guilt I had losing those children. But if I had known I was hurting my son as well, I... I... I would have... Perhaps I would have realized earlier how much of a prideful fool I had become. I... think I know what's going on here. You like me, Glitchy, don't you? <laughs> oh man, look at you. You're in love with a soulless being. Hilarious, as if this was working. Where is he? How did you? No! No, Dr. Master! Huh? Dr. Master! No! Oh, what have you done? What have you done? Doesn't it feel nice to have someone care about you so much? To have someone who wants to revolve their entire life around you? But if it feels so good, then why does it feel more and more like something horrible is going to happen? Maybe that's why I tried stopping myself at first. But the feeling is too strong now. I don't care anymore, Inano. I have to tell you, I'm... I'm madly in love with you. It feels like every last inch of my body, every drop of blood in me, is screaming your name. I don't want to go back to being flowy again. I don't want to lose Azriel. <laughs> I just, I just want everything back the way it was. <laughs> Your soul makes up a big part of who you are. When you were flowy, your soul was lost. You weren't whole. You weren't you. Everything that happened when you were flowy, there was nothing that you could have changed to prevent how it all happened. Not if this could happen to someone as good as you. You are not flowy anymore. You are Asriel. And Asriel does deserve a second chance. I'll fix your soul, I promise. So you'll never have to be flowy again. I... Thank you, Frisk. And the only reason why I was looking at you in the first place was because you were sitting with the Dawn. You got a thing for the old man, then. I don't have a thing for criminals. Or mobsters. Or criminal mobster monsters who think they can stroll into a lady's bathroom just because they see something they like. Hmm. All those monsters out there that are suffering and miserable, who've never seen the sun, we're going to get them out. We're going to set them free. It's going to happen. It just... It makes my heart feel like it's on fire, you know what I mean? I want to take that last soul with my own hands. To see the humans face justice for all this. To make everyone's dreams come true. I want to save everyone. And we're going to do it! We're going to do it, Asgore! Yes, yes, calm down. Every hero has a duty to save the day And you're a villain who stands in our way And I stand for everyone in all the kingdom All their hopes are held high And I will now sing them Your life I'm gonna crush Feeling a sudden rush And past death I will push Our hopes will not be hushed Papyrus! Hi, do you want to be my friend? 
excuse me, I have a puzzle you can do. Uh, I was actually... Don't worry, it's one of my best ones. It's way better than whatever you were doing. So, I was talking to... Hey, did you know my brother can read very fast? He reads all the time. The other day he was telling me about these things called molecules. Papyrus tries very hard. No, I mean, beyond that. Like, who he is, metaphorically. Oh, uh, wow. Um... I see a good person, I think. Even if he looks sad sometimes, I think he has a good heart. He seems like the kind of guy who makes good choices to me. I told Chris that I would talk with Susie. Do it. Hey, S -S Susie? Yeah? Uh, I... Uh... Look, Papyrus didn't come to his meeting today. Say what you want about him. He's weird, he's naive, he's self-absorbed, but Papyrus has never missed a meeting. And no matter what time you call him on the phone, night, day, afternoon, morning, he always answers within the first two rings. But now he's gone. And his brother isn't around either. What did you do to him? What did you do to him? Papyrus, who I have trained every day, even though I know he's too goofy to ever hurt anyone. Go ahead. Prepare however you want. But when you step forward, I will kill you. <laughs>